Smoking Session, ho. Back in this bitch again for another motherfucking reaction for y'all. Listen, you already know what it is. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend, bitch. Tell your motherfucking mama now. Real niggas relate. Bitch niggas will never understand. I'm smoking on some no seed on today. So make sure you get your motherfucking blunts, your bongs, your joints, your motherfucking vaporizers, your edibles ready. We about to motherfucking dive into what we got today. We got DJ Academics speaking on yo, yo Gotti allegedly sleeping with Gucci man and wife. So let's see what the fuck they talking about. Y'all know I'm going to let y'all know what the fuck I think. So uh, let me know what you think in the motherfucking comments. Also, you know what? Let, start letting me know what the fuck y'all think. No, start letting me know what y'all smoking on. Because, you know, I'm going to let you know what I'm smoking on. You, I'm going to let you know what the fuck I'm smoking on every time. Let me know what y'all smoking on. Let me know what y'all puffing on while y'all watching this shit with me. And we're going to dive right into this bitch. My name is Hero. I'm from the south side. <laughs> if you ain't from my side, throw up your side like and subscribe, my nigga. Game time. Let's get right into this bitch. Here, y'all can't get over a girl's past. Gucci has it. Would y'all get over your girl's past? That she nigga? Hey, hey, hey. If, if, yo, would y'all wife, would y'all wife, let, let's put it to a random girl. Or, like, mm. Let me know what you... And you got to understand it's under certain circumstances that nigga locked up. Could you get over it, my nigga? You give a fuck, man. Ask yourself. Shaquisha. You, you ain't been Shaquisha if you get locked up and she fucks your man who, like, who, who live across town that's, y'all kind of okay, but y'all, like, I say y'all off, but, like, like she know, like, y'all kind of homies a little bit. Yeah. First of all, if a bitch fucking your homies, whether you're locked up or not, that bitch is a motherfucking whore. The bitch fucking your homie. Your motherfucking homie. It's a billion niggas out here. You fuck anybody you motherfucking want to. Just don't fuck the family or the friends. That's all I'm saying. Don't fuck the family or the friends. Nah, shout out to Gucci Mane's wife. That's all I gotta say. We can use any relationship. Let's use a, another God. girl in the industry. Like, say Gucci another Mane girl. and his wife. No. Okay, but she's not. But that's okay, different that's because nice. she's not yeah. really in the industry. She doesn't. Her, she's not a professional in the industry. She's Yo, his yeah, wife. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. her role. So she's able to play her role. Nah, nah, nah. Hold on now. And I'm going to be really respectful. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's talk about this. Because if we really talk about Gucci and his wife, a lot of y'all would be like, Gucci's wild. Y'all know allegedly Gucci's wife, while he was locked up, slept with Yogati, right? Allegedly. Yeah, but nigga, that's not what you just asked. You just asked if you were locked up and your girl slept with your homeboy, could you get over that? What Gucci situation has nothing to do with that as far as we're fucking concerned, my nigga. We com we completely switch conversations. The initial question was, could you get over your bitch sleeping with a homie? Maybe he not a op. That's what he just said, right? Y'all can rewind the shit. A nigga that she knows that that don't have nothing to do with this situation. That's why he cuts tight like Angelie. I don't know if y'all notice. By the way, Gucci, I love you so much. Like, don't ever diss me. I'm, I'm, I love you, bro. But still, like, that's why he was mad. So, that's if nice. let me ask y'all now. Gucci's wife is a queen. I agree. But all the is up in here, y'all can't get over a girl's past. Gucci had to. You didn't ask, can you get over a girl's past, my nigga? You ask, could you get over your girl fucking one of your homeboys or nigga that she knows of through you? Again, rewind the tape. I'm not bullshitting. Would y'all get over your girl's past? Getting over a girl's past is completely different. Now, your first question was, if your girl... Fuck the nigga that you knew while you was locked up. I said whether you was locked up or not. If my bitch fuck 
one of the homies? You are a fucking hoe to me? That's my opinion. Then you switched it to, can you get over a girl's past? Every girl has a fucking past. There isn't no such thing as not getting over a girl's past. Every fucking female you ever gonna meet in your life has talked or dealt with a nigga before you. That's not the same fucking conversation. I like how he switched that shit up, though. <laughs> I mean, if we yeah, need more I'm details. Like, I feel like I'm, I'm a real nigga, bro. Yeah, but it depends on the it's agreement you have in the relationship. If I say I'm going to give you $200,000. Hold on, no. Gucci at that time, thing. Gucci at that time was mad bitches. But the girl he was going to settle down with that he always had an extra shit for was Keisha Kaor. Well, I, I think I'm saying her last name right. However, Dior, she, Dior? or the Dior, uh, I, I, whatever. Anyway. He wasn't with her his whole time. He was also kind of running around a little bit. When she, you know what I mean, decided to do her a little bit, allegedly, she might have been with, with, with Yo Gotti. Would y'all, like most of y'all, y'all demonize any girl that was ever with another rapper that y'all could recognize. Who married that this girl, he realized she was a good girl who held... You keep jamming the two together, it's two different questions, my nigga. Um, and who also helped him out with a lot of shit. I don't know if y'all would do that. Y'all told me about none of us, about none of us are rich and have to deal with, you know, the next bitch is probably going to do that shit or do even worse. So, like, for him, it's probably like, all right, she's as down as it's going to get. I'm going to stay with her. But, you know, we could talk, but it, we're not in that situation where, like, no, you know, feel, we're, yeah, yeah, we're running through bad bitches and, like, we know they're just fucking us because we have money. And, and and one thing is, if she cheated on him when he was in jail, okay, okay one thing is... Well, hold on, hold on. It wasn't really cheat on. I don't think they were together. But, like, you exactly. know, again, okay. yo, yo, see, yo, My nigga, now you walking this shit back. You got me confused, my nigga. Yo, would y'all wife, would y'all wife, let's, let's put it to a random girl, or like Shaquisha. You you wife in Shaquisha, if you get locked up and she fucks your man who like, who, who live across town that's, y'all kind of okay, but y'all like. I, you see, it's two different questions. He asked in the first question again in relation to the Gucci and your, that shit, it just don't make no sense to me, my nigga. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. It don't make no sense to me. I feel like, like she know, like y'all kind of homies a little bit. Y'all homies ain't gonna be. Nah, she's she 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 gotta get out of here. Bro, but I got out of here. And they right. The Gucci and we we ain't talking about the Gucci and mother and his girl shit. The question yo you just asked. If your bitch fuck one of the homies or one of a nigga you didn't cross paths with. Why you locked up after the fact me and you good? That don't have nothing to do with a, a, a female in her past. It's just my opinion. I mean, you already know what we at with it. Let me know what the fuck y'all think in the comments. Fuck with y'all the next video. Let's go. Game time.